Hello and welcome to Applied for the with Experts Video Series. My name is Bernd Gerstenberger. I'm Knowledge Domain Expert for AutoCAD and Specialized Toolset and Escalation Lead for AutoCAD Plan for the Today's topic are the new features of AutoCAD Plan for the 2023. We have several new features to present. The new features are grouped in separate videos. In this video, I want to present several other improvements in 2023 regarding isometric drawings beside of a topic isometric annotation, which was covered in a separate video. In this video, we will cover file naming, PCF per ISO sheet, instruments in the bill of material. Let us start with file naming. The file naming section in Project Setup, which will be used for resulting file names of the isometric drawing, is improved in 2023. Formerly in 2022 and older versions, you could see in not isometric drawing settings ISO style setup a single line to configure the isometric file name. This wasn't really user friendly as you should already know the property name and you have to frame them by the person symbol. This was okay for advanced users, but a challenge for beginners. This has been changed in 2023. Look how it looks like now in 2023. There's a button now to add attributes. Enter either from tab plan for D or from tab PCF some attributes here. Note that you see only pipeline group properties here. This is because the value of a property has to be unique for the whole pipeline to define the file name. When creating an isometric drawing, by default you are also creating a PCF file. You can open the PCF file by a normal text editor like Notepad. The attributes which you see here from a top till the last attribute called uh, tracing spec can be used for file naming. What values will be shown here can be configured by adopting the ISO ATR file of a used ISO style. Next feature, PCF per ISO sheet. By default, one PCF file will be created independently of a count of ISO sheets. But it can be configured that for each ISO sheet, a separate PCF file will be created. Note that a single PCF file for a whole isometric drawing will still be created. This was already a new feature in version 2021 and also posted in this video blog series as a separate video. But at that time, the configuration has to be done directly in the ISO config XML file. Now with 2023, it is possible to set this configuration directly in project setup as a permanent setting or in the advanced setting during ISO creation as a temporary setting for that specific isometric drawing. For permanent setting, open project setup and switch to a not isometric drawing setting, ISO style default settings, and check create PCF per ISO sheet. For the temporary setting, run either quick ISO or a broad ISO. In the dialog, click advanced settings. A dialog pops up. Check here, create PCF per ISO sheet. Moving over to the next isometric feature, instruments in the bill of material or shop BOM. Till 2022, it was a manual process by adopting the table directly in the ISO DWT file and the ISO config XML file of a used ISO style. This is not needed anymore. Just open project setup Switch to not isometric drawing settings, title block and display. Click button setup title block. In the ribbon, click table setup. A dialog pops up. 
Here you see a new checkbox, include instruments in BOM. Just check with to include instruments to a bill of material for your isometric drawings. So these were the improvements for isometric drawings for version 2023. I hope it was useful for you. I'm looking forward for your comments to this video. Thank you for your time and goodbye.